and g'day everybody it's Matt here and welcome to the next um, video in living with blood erectrophy uh, this one's gonna be titled living with blood erectrophy the light at the end of the tunnel now just before I start this one I just want to give out a disclaimer to people out there that um, this one's going to be a little bit on the harder side to discuss with you people. Um, I just want to say there's going to be a handful of people that can relate and the rest of the people out there. Um, congratulations on having a good life and I'm happy for you guys that you guys don't struggle which is brilliant to hear but there's a majority of us like me included we have issues and it's hard to be happy all i can say and for those that have a good life who don't struggle with blood or extra feet you have a perfect life that's great and I'm happy to hear that that is fantastic news um, but why have I picked this subject light at the end of the tunnel well with blood or extra fee there are going to be people that have struggled and it's very hard to focus on that light at the end of the tunnel and we struggled all the time people some of the people me included and what I want to try and say is we struggle everyone struggles with this the ones that have the problems we come off the rails very easily and it's hard to get back onto the rails with all of that it's hard and we need to help more people we need to try and reach out to the people that are struggling we need to try and check on people are you okay because there are people that are living with this condition afraid to ask for help on the on the groups because they're scared they don't they're worried that people are going to say oh please go away leave us alone or something so they just go into their rooms hide and just don't look after their health at all it's a very big struggle to utter extra feet. The mental side of things for everyone that lives with it is hard. But you've also got the physical side. And with what we've been dealt with in our cards, it's a hard, hard thing to live with. And I know that you guys are
sometimes you want to try and give them the best care you want and it's a struggle you just need to try and stay strong I know it's hard and you get really upset and you want to take the pain away from your child you want to bear their load and I understand that it's a struggle for everyone so just focus on your child like you already have and if you need to offload yourself do it because as a parent you matter as well you matter as well you know like I said there's a light at the end of the tunnel you know we need to try and get this out there that there is a light at the end of the tunnel we keep trying to live life to our fullest and there are going to be days where we're going to fall off the rails and plummet but please reach out there are a lot of people there to help there's light at the end of the tunnel it's a struggle for everyone and we need to as a community reach out and help I know we've got our own dramas and problems but a load if someone has a load help them lighten their load a little bit give them a hello how are you feeling and they'll do the exact same thing back to you um just try and be happy for the people out there and if you are struggling with family friends that don't understand your condition it's okay to be upset about that but remember there's light at the end of the tunnel we also need to say to the medical field that we need a lot of help mentally physically and I just want to say thank you to the doctors, the nurses, the GPs that day in and day out who look after bladder extrophy are doing an amazing job. They work their guts out day in day out to make sure that we have the best life we have we can. We have a I know there's people that are struggling to understand that right now and it's okay to struggle but remember there's light at the end of the tunnel to the organizations that are out there you guys are doing an amazing job as well keep supporting the people that need to be supported and we can as a family help one another to get to the light at the end of the tunnel because once we find that light and we head in the right direction everything should be okay everything should be fine should be fine we need to focus we need that tunnel vision to aim for the light at the end of the tunnel I know we're gonna wiggle off from side to side and not follow that line but if you feel that you're off track let people know they are here to help so just focus on all that's out there okay don't worry about are happening in the future just focus okay focus there's a lot at the end of the tunnel we I know there are people that are hurting and to have water extra feet on top of your hurting it's not fun I know but remember to focus it's not an easy thing I know but 
about one week of focus to get that line of sight back to the light at the end of the tunnel. We can pull in, pull in, and get there. Remember, we are here to help, and if you are struggling, please see your GP, your urologist. Tell them that you need help and they're going to be happy to help. We need to follow that light and we need to try and follow, follow the light at the end of the tunnel. If you need some guidance, ask me for help. Ask everybody out there the help we are here okay we're not gonna run away we're not gonna leave we might lay dormant but we're not gonna fully give up on our follow blood or extra few people you know I wish I could help more with you guys but because of my mental health it's hard but for me to offload the way I am on camera this is easy for me to do than trying to be a keyboard warrior you know back in the day I was a bit of a keyboard warrior but now that my mind has focused on a different line video for me is going to help people like you so if you are struggling remember there is light at the end of the tunnel just focus on that light and if you see dark problems along your way, reach out, call, lean on to someone that's out there and tell them, hey, I need help. Try and spread the word that it's okay to ask for help. It's okay to be out there, alright? So if you all just... Focus. There is light at the end of the tunnel. Remember that? And like I said before, thank you to everybody that's out there that has helped hundreds of people with blood or extrophy. You guys are amazing. You keep up the good work and tell everyone there is light at the end of the tunnel. And if you are feeling low blues, all the blue, bluey, please just reach out, say, Oi, mate, I need help. And there will be people galore coming to help you. Trust me, mate. Everybody is here to help. And with everything that's been going on the last couple of years, we desperately need to try and find the light at the end of the tunnel all right we will be here for you and let's just keep focusing on the day ahead and please try and not look back from the from yesterday because we've got to focus on the positives that's happened in life and Please, 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 please follow the light at the end of the tunnel. Remember, we're here to help. You guys have a fantastic day, evening, and I will go and now ride my kangaroo to the shops. Okay, guys, I'll see you guys later. Have a wonderful evening, day. And see you guys in the next one of these videos. Okay guys, bye guys.